dreadfully drawn is changing. We're moving forward, we're progressing, we're trying to do something new. Uh, I've created a new Instagram account. That's that's the top and bottom of it. So I said dreadfully drawn up in 2017. I'll try and keep this very brief. And the idea was that I've always wanted to be a caricature artist. And this seemed like a good way to try and do that, basically. Without any sort of pressure. Just didn't care what anyone thought about it, to be honest. So this felt like a good way to try and do what I wanted to do. Over the past year or so, maybe two years, it's gradually gravitated towards Liverpool Football Club and I'm fine with that. I don't have any problem with that, but I just feel like that work needs its own place, especially on Instagram, which is meant to be a photo-based platform, but obviously isn't. It's an Instagram reel-based platform now. So basically what I've done is created a new page which will be dedicated to Liverpool Football Club drawings. This is my own thing. It's not connected to the club in any way. It's just a fan page, essentially. But the idea is that Dreadfully Drawn will run as normal as it always has and always will do. Well, it might not always do, but like as it has been for the past five years or so. Uh, but there will be a page dedicated and devoted to my Liverpool drawings. That doesn't mean that Dreadfully Drawn as the main page will stop doing Liverpool-based work. It's not at all. In fact, it's pretty much staying exactly the same. All I'm doing is making the most of Instagram collabs, to be honest, because I want to try and build up another page and have the two work in unison. What I realised last year when Liverpool weren't playing as well is that you can't really rely on a football club for your business to run. I mean, you can if you're a multi-million pound business. When Liverpool aren't playing well, my content doesn't do as well. So there were times last season where I didn't particularly want to do a drawn but I had to because I'd said that I was going to do a drawn after every game. Where with this new platform and this new page, I can do those drawns without it necessarily affecting what happens on my dreadfully drawn page. If I don't want to post that stuff on my dreadfully drawn page, I don't have to. I don't feel like I need to or feel pressured to. And that's sort of where I'm at because I want to continue with Liverpool drawns because it's the thing I do enjoy doing. It's the thing I've done since I was a child. It's what I enjoy doing the most. So it's not that I don't want to do them anymore, it's just that I need a place that is dedicated to that stuff. And then I can do more generalized things and reels and all the content creation through Dreadfully Drawn, the, the original page, and try and work the two together, uh, which I think I think it'll be fun as well. And I, and I think Instagram, to be fair, it's got a lot of flaws, but I think this is one of their positive introductions, the, the collab feature. So basically, you collab with another account through your account, and then the work is shared, essentially. So it's shared across my two channels, but it only shows up once, is, is the point. It's not as if people are going to get two posts on their, on, their, on their feed, I think is what it's called, a feed. So that's the idea. I, I, I don't know what it is, but I feel pressure when it comes to post and stuff. Once over, I didn't, but then... I would class as a lot of people followed my account and I love it. I absolutely, I, honestly, I, I fucking love it. I love people commenting on my work. I love people messaging me and, you know, people are sound as anything, proper sound about my work. But the one thing that I, I have struggled with is when I do work that I maybe want to do and it doesn't do as well as the Liverpool stuff, which I, I, I fully understand that is what it's inevitable that that's going to happen because people follow me for the Liverpool work or whatever and it it, it, it shouldn't bother me but it's it just it stops me from doing the work because I think oh well, no one's really bothered about that and that's where I struggle and that's where I, I hope things might change where this change and this new account might give me the creative freedom to just relax a bit more because I'm not relaxing with it and, and the minute it becomes a bit of a a hassle and I lose interest and lose enjoyment that's when I that's when I start getting down about it because I fucking love dreadfully drawn you know I, I, I really do love dreadfully drawn so that's sort of where I'm at with it I don't know why I had to say that in such a broken up way that's where I'm at with it and I'm excited to get started and I think it should be good fun I think it I think it should be good fun I said on my on my introduction reel that it could go down the shitter and it could but if it does, it does, and I've tried, and that's, you know, what can you do other than say that you've tried, and you keep trying, and you keep trying. You'll get nowhere if you don't try, and I'm trying, 
I'm trying to enjoy it. I'm trying to have fun with it. I'm trying to spread the word because I feel passionately about it. So that's where we're at. Dreadfully Drawn is changing. It's evolving. I'm not stopping doing it. I thought about stopping doing it, but I'm not stopping. I'm not stopping. I put too much work into it, too much effort into it, too much time into it. And I'd be lost without it. I am going to do a song because I'm feeling good. It might be, sh it might be short because I think the chords... I, I think I've tried playing this before and it, the chords were... The chords were quite difficult, to be fair. The chords are difficult. I've just seen the list of the chords that are on this song. They are difficult. Still don't know what I was waiting for And my time was running wild A million dead end streets and Every time I thought I got it made It seemed the taste was not so sweet So I turned myself Ooh, what's that called there? What's that called I've just played? So I turned myself to face me I'm definitely not playing that one That's definitely not the fucking chord Thank you for watching. Feel free to follow the new account. It's in the link below. It's called Dreadfully Liverpool. Feel free to subscribe because I am, believe it or not, I am trying to build up YouTube as well. Thank you for watching. I hope you understand if you if you follow my work. I hope you do understand my, my thought process behind it. It's warm in here, you know. This room is fucking warm.